I sat down and watched The Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard. What did I think? In a word, hilarious. Wasn't perfect, but man, did I laugh my ass off. All right, guys, let's talk about this because this has been a mixed bag of reviews from what I've read from other guys or watched from other YouTube channels. A lot of guys are saying that this was a bad movie. I've seen a lot of guys saying that this was a very entertaining movie. I'm going to say if you want to sit down, just relax, watch something pointless and funny. Just You just don't care about the movie. You just want to laugh. You want to see action and you want to laugh. This is that movie. Again, it's not perfect. Don't expect realism because that's not what this movie is about. It's not about realism. It's not about what are the possibilities that a spy or a bodyguard could do this. What if this assassin actually did this? No, just throw that out the window. It's not about that. This is pure comedy at its best. Now, there's been a lot of comedies out there where I've laughed a couple times throughout the movie, but this movie had me laughing a lot. Like, it really had me laughing from beginning to end. Ryan Reynolds killed it in this movie. He plays this role so well. And it follows the first one, Hitman's Bodyguard. It follows up him daydreaming about being the best bodyguard in the world and following in his father's footsteps and all of these other things. But his last run in with Kincaid has kind of left him questioning himself and he needs a sabbatical, so to speak. He needs to go take a vacation, get guns and shooting and violence off his mind for a while, just relax. But he can't do that because Selma Hayek's character comes ripping him out of vacation to help free her husband, Kincaid. These guys got a lot of history, and they do not like each other. But for some reason, they work well together. The chemistry that Ryan Reynolds and Samuel L. Jackson have, it's pure movie magic. They mesh so well. And Selma Hayek, she is just that extra spice on top with her Latino attitude, always screaming and yelling at people and just going in guns a blazing, so to speak, with no regard of a plan or any kind of uh, caution. She's just all in all the time. And um, she's just she meshes really well with Ryan Reynolds in... I guess, I don't want to say coercing him into doing something, but sweet-talking him into doing what she wants um, while trying to be sincere to what Ryan Reynolds is thinking or what he needs. So it's a really strong mixture of action, comedy, while trying to roll that all up into some weird love story. All of which makes no sense whatsoever. So again, if you want a movie that makes sense, that is logical, this is not that movie. If you want one that you're just gonna sit there and laugh, watch explosions, watch some high scream bloody murder at people in Spanish, no idea what she's saying, but just by the tone of her voice, you know she's pissed. This is that movie. This is the movie you need to watch. Now, of course, the movie's not complete without Samuel L. Jackson dropping a lot of MFers throughout the whole movie, and he does every couple seconds, it seems like, because he tends to want to butt heads with Ryan Reynolds' character. Now, I know it's all in good fun, because deep down, deep down, I think these two care about each other. I think they want to be friends, but they'll never admit it but they want to. Awesome movie, guys. I'm just going to plain out say, very simply, fun movie. Go watch it. If you want a good time, grab some popcorn, watch this movie. Highly, highly recommend it. My wife and I sat and watched it and continuously laughed. So if you've already seen it, I want you to drop your comments down below what you thought of the movie. If you haven't seen it, are you going to go watch it? If you don't, you're missing out. 
On your way out, guys, do me a favor, drop a like on the video, hit that subscribe button and bell notification, of course, so you know when all the new movies drop. I'm Kevin, and I'll catch you at the concession stands.